Yeah, the web looks so far out that it's capturing light that's been traveling for over 13 billion years. Um, but the universe has been expanding, and so the light has been stretching. And so for the most distant galaxies, we're looking back, back in time almost to the Big Bang. For close to two decades, top engineers and scientists appointed by NASA, ESA and the Canadian Space Agency constructed the largest and most advanced space telescope to date. On December 25th, 2021, the James Webb Telescope embarked on its journey into orbit approximately 1.6 million kilometers from Earth. Never before have humans positioned a telescope at such profound depths in space. Webb exhibited unprecedented achievements throughout its construction. The technology, featuring 18 gold-plated honeycomb mirrors, signifies a complete revolution in telescope technology. The summer of 2022 marked the brilliant start of Webb's mission. The initial images were already awe-inspiring, and since then, a vast community of enthusiasts eagerly anticipated each new image from this super telescope. Today, we provide a brief overview and delve into some of the most captivating and puzzling discoveries. The identification of the oldest galaxies. Excitement was at its peak among astronomers during the summer as they eagerly awaited the release of the initial images from the James Webb telescope. Those in the know were aware that among the first images from James Webb would be a deep field image capturing light signals from the universe's earliest galaxies. As the images were unveiled, a race started among researchers to unveil the most compelling discoveries. Soon, there was Elation as galaxies with red light values of 10.5 and 12.5 Z emeged, signifying their existence a mere 350 million years after the Big Bang. Subsequent revelations brought news of galaxies with red light shift values soaring up to 20 Z, challenging preconceived notions about the cosmos's development. The Schrodinger Galaxy. In October 2022, Harvard University researchers presented Sears 1749, an ancient galaxy that surpassed all prior discoveries. With an approximately 16.4 Z red light value, this galaxy not only boasted an exceptionally advanced age, but also posed an entirely new, unsolvable mystery for the researchers to unravel. A subsequent measurement yielded a redshift of 5C, suggesting that this galaxy might be closer to us and younger than initially assumed. The measurement results replicated themselves, leading to the intriguing revelation that this galaxy seems to have existed at a point in time approximately 13.5 billion years ago, only to suddenly appear billions of years younger. This peculiar circumstance bestowed the nickname Schrodinger Galaxy upon Sears 1749, drawing inspiration from Schrodinger's cat and implying the possibility of Sears 1749 existing simultaneously in two places and two times. Starbirth. In November 2022, the James Webb Space Telescope treated us to an image of a colorful hourglass-shaped cloud. Nestled in its center is a nascent star, the protostar labeled L1527, captured by Webb's near cam. The inclusion of this near-infrared camera stands out as a significant advantage for the new telescope. In contrast, Hubble lacks comparable technology, relying exclusively on optical sensors, making it susceptible to interference from gas or dust in space and compromising observation sharpness. The protostar depicted in this image is 100,000 years old. Following 500,000 years of evolution, the star will accumulate enough mass to initiate nuclear fusion, causing it to radiate light. Stefan's Quintet. Hubble has previously provided an impressive image of the galaxy group Stefan's Quintet. However, Webb, armed with its potent infrared camera and exceptionally high spatial resolution, managed to reveal this distinctive assembly of five galaxies in greater detail than ever before. Among experts, Stefan's Quintet is also recognized as Hickson Compact Group 92, or HCG 92. Despite being labeled a quintet, only four galaxies actively participate in the cosmic dance, while another stands slightly off to the side. Scientists speculate that in the early universe, galaxy groups like these were more prevalent. The top galaxy, named NGC 73119, features a core 
housing a supermassive black hole that doubles as a quasar, emitting light energy equivalent to an impressive 40 billion suns. Quasars likely generate their radiation, spanning billions of light years, through accelerated particles colliding with a shock front and experiencing abrupt deceleration. This process visibly releases radiation in the X-ray range, eventually giving rise to other long-wave radiation components, which we recognize as light. The pillars of creation within the giant Eagle Nebula, Webb identified a formation in October 2022, previously observed by Hubble. However, the new telescope has significantly enhanced the clarity and sharpness of this cosmic phenomenon known as the pillars of creation. Researchers aim to deepen their understanding of this formation, located 6,500 light years away, thanks to the advanced capabilities of Webb's technology. The youthful stars depicted by the bright red spheres just beyond the columns, formed as colossal accumulations of gas and dust, succumbed to gravity and collapsed. The undulating lines in the image represent ejections from even younger stars still enshrouded within gas and dust, estimated to be a mere few hundred thousand years old. First exoplanet, shifting focus to the James Webb Telescope, the first exoplanet exploration marks a significant leap in cosmic understanding, specifically crafted to not only delve into the origins of the cosmos, but also to revolutionize exoplanet studies. Webb tackles the challenge of identifying these diminutive, lightless entities scattered throughout the vastness of space. Positioned deeply in space with ultra-fine instrumentation, Webb is poised to pioneer the examination of the atmospheres of planets beyond our solar system, a groundbreaking endeavor. In the preliminary application of Webb's methodology, scientists directed their attention to the planet HIP 65426b. Subsequently, the image underwent recalculation using diverse filters, each accentuating distinct wavelengths. By analyzing the light radiation and reflections, valuable insights into the planet's age, mass and surface characteristics were gleaned. Utilizing this technique, we now possess knowledge that HIP 65426b is approximately 14 million years old, with temperatures ranging from 1,000 to 1,400 degrees Celsius, and a mass between 6 to 12 times that of Jupiter. The efficacy of imaging the planet so distinctly is enhanced by an additional instrument, the coronagraph, which effectively eliminates interfering light from the central star. Exoworld carbon dioxide. James Webb ventured into the realm of exoplanets with WASP-39b. Positioned approximately 700 light years away from Earth, this planet orbits a sun-like star. It became evident that WASP-39b, akin to Saturn in mass, defied norms by exhibiting an unusually high temperature for a gas planet, reaching 900 degrees. Initially discovered in 2011, a recent study by Webb researchers at Johns Hopkins University uncovered a peculiar aspect of the planet's environment, a rarity in space. Once again, employing near-infrared color spectrum analysis, Webb presented the initial credible evidence of carbon dioxide within the exoplanet's atmosphere. Carbon dioxide holds significance in the quest for extraterrestrial life. Detecting this compound on a rocky planet could significantly enhance the probability of discovering the first exoplanet with life. Newly unveiled Jupiter. When this image became public, initial reactions led many to think, hmm, this object seems somewhat familiar, yet not entirely. However, enthusiasts of Jupiter quickly identified their beloved planet particularly recognizing the prominent spot. The near-infrared camera's images portray the red spot in white, altering Jupiter's usual colors due to filtering. These filters offer insights into specific details. Notably, the images reveal unprecedented clarity of the vast auroras in the north and south, while also providing a glimpse of the planet's delicate rings and two of its moons, the Cartwheel Galaxy. The Cartwheel Galaxy stands out among the lesser-known but equally fascinating findings, a galaxy vortex that appears highly agitated and slightly chaotic. Beyond its appearance, this stellar collection reveals a rich history, 
scientists had previously determined that approximately one billion years ago, two galaxies collided in this region. The collision-induced cosmic dust had obscured the details until now, but Webb's infrared cameras effortlessly penetrated this dusty veil. Consequently, the galaxy, recently battered by cosmic standards, emerges with unprecedented clarity in this observation. Researchers propose that the Cartwheel Galaxy was once part of a large spiral structure, akin to the Milky Way, before enduring a forceful collision with another galaxy. The name Cartwheel derives from the bright inner ring and vibrant outer ring, giving the galaxy the appearance of a cartwheel. Cosmic Fingerprint. One of Webb's novel discoveries is the Cosmic Fingerprint, this image unveils 17 concentric dust rings originating from a pair of stars located approximately 5,000 light-years away. Known as Wolf Rayet 140 among experts, these rings result from the intricate dance of the two stars and the collision of stellar winds propelling them into space. The dust formation occurs cyclically, with the stars converging in their orbits approximately every eight years generating a new dust loop resembling tree rings. James Webb's MIRI spectrometer not only facilitated the observation of this cosmic spectacle, but also enabled astronomers to analyze the dust's composition simultaneously. The capabilities of the new telescope open up incredible possibilities in astronomical exploration. Scientists are currently immersed in a wealth of new data and insights anticipating decades of research to decipher these remarkable and often perplexing discoveries. As Webb delivers data, it invariably sparks numerous new questions. Feel free to share which of these discoveries has intrigued you the most, or inquire about any specific image you'd like to explore further. Your astronomical knowledge contributions are always welcome. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more content.